Wee. Are we going to play some more Crazy Frog? Yes, we are. Indeed. And this is the Crazy Tone. Uh, we went back and you and changed his character, but I kept mine. Yeah. Because I, I lo actually looked at the stats this time. Turns out he had the fastest character. Yep. With the best handling. Yeah. So why, why change what works? <sighs> is right. Good lord, this game is so fast. Oh, the road is twisting weird. Stop it. Oh, my <laughs> stomach. So, back to the Drawing topic book. of uh, uh, flash, games? flash games. Yeah. I recall playing this game that I came back to recently, and it was really, really good. And there was actually sequels of it, but uh, Pokemon Tower Defense. Oh, yeah? It's actually so good. If they made that into a legitimate game, I would pay out the friggin' wallet for that. Like You'd actually pay for a Pokemon game? Hell yeah. Disgusting. Because it's so <laughs> much fun. If you guys want to play it, go to Newgrounds and just search Pokemon uh... Tower Defense. It's really fun. I'd recommend it to anyone. It's got little challenges and stuff. It's, it's just really fun. But, uh, I gotta say... I grew up with a lot of Flash games. I used to spend my lunch breaks as well, going out and <laughs> playing those, because I was a free nerd, didn't have many friends to hang out with, and computers uh, were always open in the library. My favorite tower defense was Desktop Tower Defense by Coffee Stain Studios. I've heard of that. Yeah. Huh. It still exists, too. Yeah, huh. yeah it even has a version 2.0 right now. Wow. With, like, leaderboards and stuff. The concept of tower defense has sort of become antiquated at this point, where everything needs to be a first-person game. So even if it is a tower defense, it's like, oh, first-person tower defense, where you have to go around and do this and that and this and that. Yep. There's one called Sanctum, and the sequel, Sanctum 2. It's a first-person shooter with tower defense. Oh. Yeah. I also noticed Terraria... It's on Steam. It's pretty good. Terraria added its own uh, tower defense add-on. It's really fun, but... How'd that work? Uh, you place down this one item, and you get to just fend off enemies from both sides of the map. And you can earn specific loot that you can't get in-game. Huh. And you get to place down stuff that you've bought, like uh, catapults and ballistas and towers and stuff. It's, it's neat. I Did don't you know find the it, horn button? I don't know if it ever... Yeah, it's a circle. <laughs> if the game ever got made, but it was a Minecraft lookalike, but um, anything you built was called technology, and the more things you built, it would attract more enemies faster, so it became a tower defense. Oh. So you had to like build a generator to power your turrets, so that was two tech, which would attract an enemy. And then it was still Minecraft, so you had to like, get blocks and stuff. Oh, so that's very... Uh... So you had to, like, make a Clever. forge to get a pickaxe, which is technology. Yeah. The only question to that is there an end game to it. Probably not. I'd assume it'd just go until you lose. Yeah, that's where I would see a bit of flaw with it. But, Cause... like, torches were, like, these little beacons you can place, like, on walls and stuff. And torches were technology, so they like, follow you into tunnels. Uh -huh. Yeah. Or if, or if you, like, made a wall behind you, they'd like start breaking blocks in a straight line toward you. Yeah. What I find with uh, Tower Defense is it really needs to have a sort of end goal you're going towards. Because if you're just going for an infinite uh, infinite game, you're going to lose a lot of people within the first few days, even, of just having it out. Well, I don't know if the game ever got made. Yeah, I guess that's... <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah. But, uh, but that's what it was. Huh. Yeah. I'd be interested in looking into making something like that. I recently went back and uh, tried some... I didn't even try some coding. I just looked at it and I was like, oh, it's so much. And I have been so out of practice that I just did not want to get back into it. Start coding in Unity. Make a VR game and I'll beta test it for you. I will make it so you throw up. <laughs> Want to play a roller coaster janky. game? <laughs> oh my god. I think I may or may not have tried that at uh, the one university. 
Ooh. It, it's a Steam game. It's released recently. Okay. Yeah. Because I remember trying a VR headset. <sighs> Can't remember what the university's called, but it was really cool. I was there for a tech conference? Yeah. Math and technology for like a math competition and junk. Because you're a nerd. Needless to say, I did awful. Well, yeah. Because, uh... Look at you. you. You don't even do your own taxes. Yeah, I'm a lazy boy. I, I do my taxes, and I hate <laughs> math. Taxes are easy. I pay other people to do my taxes. Whoa, shortcut. Is it a shortcut, though? You're still in... Fi no, I fell off the map. Oh, my God. Back onto the track. This is such... BS. The tracks are too narrow. Especially right after view. the jump. Yeah. Whoop. And just randomly the edges will be gone or they'll be back. If it wasn't for that, it would probably feel a lot better to play. If the tracks were wider like Mario Kart? Yeah. Yeah. Or variation. Or had more AI players that could actually race. Because I've, I've fallen off like three times now and I'm, I'm in second. I'm in first. <laughs> Yeah. Like, there's no reason for that. Although, we are playing it on easy. That's true. They might have just turned off rubber band AI yeah. for that. Whoa, rip. Oh, okay. Same thing here. Cool. Cool. Yeah, that, that was fun. I love going over a hill that turns into somehow a jump over just a dead the rail. Drop. Yeah. Great game design. Right into the volcano. I think they did sort of copy Mario Kart, because I believe when you pick up those uh, coins, you go faster. I can't tell. I have the fastest character, so I'm always going fast. Gotta go Sonic fast. Oh, we still have all those Sonic games to play, too. Oh, no. How many of them? All of them. Too many so of them. So many. Even some duplicates. <laughs> Two Guess copies of Sonic and the Secret Rings. Yeah. Sonic and the Secret Rings. <laughs> As a kid, I was actually tempted to purchase them because I was a fan of Sonic. Most kids were. And now? Now you know better. Now I am repulsed most of the time by it. There's only one good Sonic game. Colors or Generations? Sonic 2 for the Genesis. Oh, That's two. it. Three ruined it by adding knuckles. Knuckles. Yeah. Him and his fist nipples. <laughs> uh, so true. Yeah. What are all these other characters in the game? Like, I recall seeing the robot what? in one of the. This game or Sonic? This game. Oh. Because I recall seeing the robot in one of the music videos, all these other characters, I don't think they exist in the videos. I may have to rewatch them. I fell off the same cliff. But then again, I don't want to rewatch them. I've only ever seen the one crazy frog, and that was the first one. And then I give up hope on humanity. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> So it's impossible not to get power-ups when you go past them. Oh, yeah? Because they put a line of them. Like, lengthwise along the track. Like, how are you supposed to miss uh, all of them? There's not even enough players to pick up all those. Well, I guess I'll just go frick myself. Then why do they even bother making a, a line of them? Why do they just have, like... Hey, once you cross I didn't this. even fall off. That was cheap. Yeah, on the ice map, I was falling through the ground several times over. I hadn't even landed yet or gone past the track, and it just reset me. Really? Yeah. Disgusting. No, I was, I was going to say with the items, um, instead of having, like, individual things to hit, why not just, like, a line? Whereas, like, everybody gets an item. Or, like, a, a checkpoint or something. Or just like a countdown timer, and every time the timer resets, you get an item. Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah. Just like, 
every, I don't know, 18 seconds. Your item yeah. would refresh. You see it. You'd like cool down and then it would refresh. You see another player maybe once every 30. Come on. Why does that corner not have a rail on it? Uh, yeah. Angry honking. My honk is no honk. It's just a weird. I don't understand most of these power ups. I haven't figured out what I have to, I need to do yet. I oh. think some of them are shields, some of them are. Okay. I think most of them are shields. Some of them are explosives that you can't really aim with. They That's just... the same friggin' spot! Oh, yep. No kidding. <sighs> this game's tiring not, me out. Not good? No, not really. I hate you. I actually hit you with an item. Oh, really? Yeah. Didn't really do that much to me. No? <laughs> I'm no. still here. Except I'm losing speed rapidly. Okay. I love falling off. It's fun, isn't it? Feels real good to fall off a map that uh, they don't fall off of. Okay, I didn't even cross the jump. <laughs> Did it reset you? Yep. Nice. Oh. This one six way minutes. Six minutes. Whoa! Good God! That's five minutes longer than it has and to be. And that's in first place too. <laughs> oh my You're lord! You're only nine seconds behind me. <sighs> Two minutes a lap. Ow! Painful, but uh, thanks for sticking through, it, guys. Oh. <laughs> and with that, good. Bye and good night. Goodbye.